we've gathered here today uh, supporting our coal miners that uh, recently lost their jobs. Uh, we've assembled different organizations in the county and the region to, to come and uh, offer literature and, um, and answer some questions to those miners. There are people here from organizations that will help them be able to apply for sliding scales because they've lost their health insurance so they can get cheaper health insurance. Um, to help them get prescriptions. A lot of them are suffering with getting prescriptions filled. So some of our clinics have prescription plans that help them get reduced. There's also organizations here that can help them look for jobs or go back to training. I'm with Eastern Kentucky Concentrated Employment Programs at a hazard, and that's what we do. We help people look for a job and go back to work. It's just this devastated us and destroyed us, you know. I mean, we live paycheck to paycheck, you know, like most coal miners around here do, you know. I mean, all we want to do is be able to work, you know what I'm saying? Uh, that, that's what we do, you know, we're over for three weeks plus wages, you know. So, I mean, that's really all we want to do is just be able to work. This company has really done us very dirty and uh, just had uh, pretty much reckless disregard for us, you know, in my opinion. I mean, it's just, uh, it's, it's terrible. It's a terrible situation and, you know, a lot of us don't know where, where the next you know, buy the food for our children is going to come from. You know, I mean, it's a it's a serious issue, and you know, I just you know, thank God that they set this up and trying to help us out and stuff. Talked to a lot of coal miners today. They're going to try to get involved with a lot of stuff. You know, some people's you know seeking other jobs, and some people's trying to you know maybe even change careers. You know, I mean, because you know the coal mining industry. You know, I've been in the industry for 18 years, and you know it's up and it's down. But you know, never in this fashion have we had this happen. You know, we we've all faced layoffs, but this right here is more than a layoff. You know, I mean, they they took our money that we worked that they're that we're owed. You know, they took that from us, and uh, you know, that's a pretty pretty big deal to us.